One woman has come up with a whole new vocabulary to describe today's unions. Take a look. Good morning. Pamela, if I could start with you, the, the main thesis of your book seems to be that most marriages are semi-happy. What do you mean when you say that? Um, a sem but your own marriage, semi-happy marriage, and, and, and quite bluntly, you say, I have a nice marriage, a lovely husband, but you never know on other days, and people who are watching at home might say, you know what, that's my marriage. Semi-happy, are they doomed? Is it they are not friend. Am I never going to have that? I just released data uh, last week saying that marriage, married couples are no longer in the majority. They represent just 48% of households. So is marriage on its way out? Marriage is not on We're talking about family life. We have yeah. a few seconds left. Mm -hmm. But you say that parenthood is the reason a lot of people get into marriage, but then it can be the downfall of the marriage as well. Right. Tom, Pamela Haig, thank you so much. Judith Sales, as always, thank you. We're back up to your local news. <coughs> Kathy Lee Gifford is a woman of many talents. As you just saw, she can judge a wine contest. She co-hosts our fourth hour. She is a New York Times best-selling author. Her latest is... Oh, are this, you kidding, okay? please? You people are amateurs. <laughs> yes, yes, I'm fine. I'm fine. All right, Missy Machini's second children's book you've written. Mm -hmm. Premise of this one, The Kid's a Slob. The Kid is a Slob. Um, it, it, Party Animals was last, uh, last year. And this year it's Legend of Messi Machini. And it's based, he couldn't stand being dirty. He didn't, and Cassidy was only happy if she was like a pig in mud. So why yeah. did you have the, the main character be a guy? Because Cassidy insisted on it. She said, Mommy, you've got to make him a boy or everybody's going to know it's me. Well, everybody does know it's her. And she doesn't so, care anymore. Yes. Messi comes along and, and really affects him a lot. Yeah, yeah. It says, Messi, now Messi thought he was king of the world till he discovered his world just got girled. girled. And and this pink little perfect clean thing shows up. Missy Machini. And she's just adorable and does everything right. Typical, did your kids have that kind of sibling rivalry growing up as well? Or? <laughs> well, <laughs> well, he's about to graduate from college. I know. It's it. unbelievable. I mean, you know the TV a show. A few years ago, and look at him now. You so. know what it's like. You get your art from real life. And all these songs came from from my what I what I saw with my kids. Yeah. There's a sec, this deal banana peel. This is what's got to happen so this can happen. The singing would begin. I, these kind of songs are just goofy feet and silly and turkey and pick his nose. I know. And when that. he picks his nose, he goes, look, my gold. So kids, that, that's really Cody singing that's on this. That's disgusting, I Kathy Lee. But that's disgusting. what kids do. They love all that potty humor <laughs> stuff. Nobody likes potty humor better than you, Meredith. I Mira. like a toot every once in a while. Yes, you yes, do. And a big glass of wine. It's always such a pleasure. Love you. In uh, this hour with us. Thank Congratulations. You, Thank you. What are you working on? Uh, uh, I'm going to miss you. We love you very, very Thank much, Meredith. You. you don't I make that great of wine, but I, you're, I, you're I, a great woman. Woman. My wine was called yeah. and sour. Were, yeah, it's sour. <laughs> okay, the book is called The Legend of Messi Machini.